Can I be honest here? <laughs> it never disappoints. Especially when LeBron's in the league. It never, ever disappoints. This is a bean bag. I've been going jeans cause I'm cool right. For the spaceship, now I'm a space cadet. Big white mansion in my habitat. What is up, you guys? It's your boy T Russ here, back with our video. And today, we talking about the trade deadline. And, uh, you know, like I said, it was an exciting one. So, let's recap. Let's recap. So, first, you have Porzingis traded for Dent Smith Jr., um, DeAndre Jordan, and Wesley Matthews. And then, they, the, uh, Mavericks also got Courtney Lee and Tim Hardaway Jr. I got my little notes here. You know what I'm saying? And then, after that, um, you know, you had, you had the, um, the Lakers making very stupid moves. Very, very stupid moves. And, uh, the Pelicans played us. Like, they clowned us. They were never going to give us AD. And basically what they want to do and what they did, I believe somebody on, what was it, first take? It was either, no, it wasn't first take. That show with Rachel Nichols. Um, the jump, the jump. Um, somebody on the jump was like, <clears throat> they were, their whole plan was to try to discombobulate our team. Was to try to... Um, make those young guys lose confidence so our whole chemistry would be messed up. And it worked for one game, you know? It worked for one game. It was the game against the uh, Pacers where um, you just saw things were going terrible. We lost by, what, 42, 44, or something like that. And, you know... The dudes on the bench weren't even sitting by LeBron, and it was just terrible. It was just terrible. And then, um, then Nick Skouskis, you know, he was involved in a three-team trade with the um, Cavs and the Rockets. Um, Nick Skouskis was um, sent to the Rockets. Nick Skouskis and Wade Baldwin both from the Blazers. They were sent to the Rockets. In return, the Rockets got, um, I believe, two second round picks. Um, or no, my bad. In return, the Cavs got Rodney Hood. And then, um, then I believe the Blazers got the um, picks. And so, you know, Nick Skouskis was on the ride. Nick Skouskis and Wade Baldwin, they Everywhere Nick Skousis went, Wade Baldwin followed. So then the Rockets trade um, the um, Skousis and Baldwin to the Pacers for some picks. And um, after that, they Nick Skousis and Wade Baldwin were broke, both cut at the same time. And it was kind of crazy. Like Nick Skousis went all around the league in about a day or less. Like, it, it, was, it was crazy. Then I feel bad for him because huh, he almost dropped 30 on them, on my Laker boys. So, I feel like he's a good player. Hey, Lakers. Hey, that, that, that boy Nick can shoot. So, you know, don't be afraid to pick him up. And then, you know, Lakers were, uh, they, they traded, uh, what's his name? Dude from Kansas, the shooting guard, um, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but y'all know who I'm talking about. And a uh, second rounder for Reggie Bullock from uh, UNC. Um, he's a great shooter, so that's de something they definitely needed. Great shooter. I use that word too loosely sometimes. He's a good shooter. Um, you know, and then um, after that, the Clippers made a pretty decent trade. Um, it was a decent trade for both sides. 76ers um, traded, um, who did they trade? Okay, well, the Clippers traded Tobias Harris. I don't know who they got for it, but, um, yeah, they, the Clippers traded Tobias Harris. And then, um, after that, oh, Milwaukee finally traded Thon Maker. 
and um to the Pistons and the Pistons gave them Stanley Johnson and you know uh, Miami Heat traded Tyler Johnson and Wayne Ellington to the Suns for Ryan Anderson the power forward who can shoot pretty good and then um you know that was really the blockbuster trades you have one more with uh, the Wizards trading Otto Porter Jr. to um to the Bulls for Bobby Portis and Jabari Parker. And then, you know, the one my favorite personally um was the Harrison Barnes trade. They traded Harrison Barnes the Mavericks trade Harrison Barnes in the middle of a game. The middle of a game. Now, this is being reported, folks, from Bleacher Report. Reportedly, Harrison Barnes, mid-game, is being traded to Sacramento for Justin Jackson and Zach Randolph. It's reportedly. Odd time of the year. Trading deadlines tomorrow afternoon. A lot of activity. The association. And they basically said, you know, get out. <laughs> You know, I can only imagine what he was thinking at that time. You know, he he got traded for Justin Jackson um, to the to the Kings, and the Mavericks got Justin Jackson, like I said. And um, you know, that was basically the trade deadline right there, trade deadline. And you know, like I said, Anthony Davis didn't get traded. But um, it did hinder our confidence in the, in the young guys and in some of the older guys, too. It hindered the confidence and the trust on that team. And then also, you know, it looked like I thought our season was probably over. Especially, I said, this is what I said. I said, if we can't get our chemistry back, if those young guys can't suck up their feelings, if LeBron, you know doesn't let he, let them know how he feels, you know, we're going to be in trouble. But, you know, it was quickly fixed in the game last night, which we'll react to later. You know what I'm saying? It was quickly fixed. And, I'm, and that's very fortunate because we're going to need that to get to the playoffs. But, um, you know, that was the trade deadline. And uh, that's it for this video. Make sure you like comment and subscribe and um i see you for the next one so text but i ain't reply say congratulations like what a guy i ain't ask you to be perfect man that's only god i just wish you would have tried so everyone everyone smile for the family photo